the Oase Crystal Skim is a new skimmer. I've used some skimmers in the past. I currently use the Eheim skimmer uh, on my maintenance days. It's really nice for collecting small plant trimmings, but I don't use any skimmers daily. And the main reason is I don't want to catch any small fish or shrimp. So here's the actual unit. It's a really sleek looking. I really like the shape of it. It's got a 6.6 .6 foot cord. It comes apart in a couple different pieces up here. This is your floating ring. So this comes off. This guard, this will come off if you want to clean it. Here's another piece that'll stop fish from getting in. Not so much shrimp. There's no skimmer out there I think that's going to protect against baby shrimp. I mean, they're so small. You got a coarse sponge underneath that. It comes with this little tool. And it's a pretty simple skimmer. Just got the impeller down here. The actual adjustment is, is this ring here. So we're gonna go full blast. This part will float. It also has two suction cups and it looks like this is adjustable on this clear mount, which is kind of nice. Let's get it in the 90 gallon and see how well it does. 90 gallon grown in pretty nice. You can see I've got inline CO2 pumping in at an uncountable amount. Oh yeah, and guess what? We got tons of surface scum. So what this is is basically a protein layer. Supposedly it could affect oxygen exchange at the top of the water. I mean, you can see all the CO2 bubbles just clinging to it. And another thing, the outlet is on the bottom of this thing, which is actually really interesting. Most of them come out the side, like the Ehinds come out, well, I guess the front. You know, the circulation in an aquarium, it kind of comes out this outlet, hits this wall, banks down, and then comes back. There's not a whole lot going on in this corner back here. So maybe I'll put that back there and we'll get a little more circulation and it'll help with the oxygen exchange too, which more oxygen means more beneficial bacteria. More beneficial bacteria means less ammonia and less ammonia means happier fish and less algae. All right, I just plugged it in and you can see it's running at full speed right now. See how that surface slime is going straight into it. I don't have any super small fish in here. I noticed with the Eheims, uh, some of my endlers would get in there, my endler guppies, because they're kind of tiny. And I, you know, I check them once a day and fish them out, and I just got sick of doing that. I just was really stressing the fish out. Here, let's see what time it is right now. It's 2.39. So this is a 90 gallon aquarium with tons of surface slime. I'll let you know how long it takes to uh, clear that out. Seems to be trapping all the plant trimmings too, which is nice. Don't mind the look of it either. I think black would have probably been a little better for this aquarium with the black background, but what are you gonna do? Oh yeah, that's doing a good job. The camera on this phone is amazing. Holy crap. Is that gray? Oh, that can't, no. Does that look gray on your screen? It's been about 15 minutes. The surface looks really good. It's done a really good job. Hello, Mr. Angel. These guys like to be the center of attention all the time. And this one's thinking about laying her eggs on it already. And that's your big old belly. Look how clean the surface of the water is. Everyone's happy, I'm happy. I think it's a great product so far. So thanks everyone for watching. Stay tuned for more videos like this. If you like this video hit that like button and if you want future content like this consider subscribing i try to upload weekly so thanks so much for your support i will talk to you guys soon